17 plus is a PlayStation. I don't believe it. Hello there. Free 24 2023. The, the, the 24th of March? It's not The Last of Us, is it? Not the remake. Arriba. Arriba. R. N. Resident Evil. Four remake. It is coming. Oh my god. It wasn't a fake. It wasn't a fake. The screenshot was real. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I saw screenshots of this on Twitter and everyone's going, it's fake. It's fake. Turns out, it's fucking real. I've just played through this last year. I'm not going to replay it again. Just because there's a remake. It doesn't need a remake. It's perfectly fine. It feels like a modern game. No. Leon! Guess you, me. Picked the wrong spot to vacation, eh? Unless it's like really different, but it doesn't look that different. You will receive our most sacred body. It begins now. I, I, I understand the remakes of the old games because they're like very different games. They're not even the same games. But this remake will probably be very similar. You know, a third-person survival game. I forget what happened that night. The pain, even for a second. Leon. This time, it can be different. It has to. Well, we've got a release date. What about the Resident Evil 8 DLC? Ooh. State of Play returns, and we've got some great PlayStation updates to share with you today. And thanks to Capcom for kicking it off with Resident Evil 4. Coming to PS5 with PlayStation VR 2 content also in development. Release date 2004? <laughs> I don't know what year it came out. Now let's get a four games in development for PlayStation Ooh, VR 2. VR for Village, but what about PC VR? 7 never got PC <sighs> VR now, support. Let's take a look at him. Well, well, Ethan Winters. You escaped my little brother's big lady games, in VR vision. Let's see how special you are. The guy's playing this, he's trying to keep his head yes, still, yes. very still. <laughs> but are they, is this going to be like a separate game you need to buy? Because <laughs> seven, the VR mode was included with the game. Let's hope this is like a free update. Man. Not the flies, they kill the frame rate. <laughs> you can do will. That's cheating. You can't do that in the regular game. Resident Evil is massive again. It's selling a lot again. Like five million plus units. VR2. Some camera angles adjusted. You, of all people, have the audacity to question me? You who emerged from the putrid waters of the bayou. The zombie game. our righteous gains and cut our throats like a demon in the night. Is it Walking Dead? What have you done to ensure the future Saints of this forsaken something. city? You, who have brought nothing but chaos.
When death was swallowing this city whole, it was I who resurrected it. It was I who shined as a beacon of hope for all. I mean, I'm not going to buy it. I'm blood. not going to buy PSVR and 2. I so vow to spill it. It's not for me. When the bells ring, the song they sing will be righteous. Oof. Retribution. Oh, saints and sinners. Retribution. Home. Chapter 2. Tourist. This year. Uh, No Man's Sky. Like, do you want to grind for materials for five hours in VR? No, me either. Bit of a dodgy frame rate there. You can't have that in VR, you'll vomit. Thing is, they can't have anything really good for VR because people will be pissed <laughs> that they can't play it because they don't own VR. You got Horizon. Where are you taking me? I asked you a question. But you're not playing as Aloy. Everyone says Reyes is a good shot. Yeah, and I'll put arrows through both of us. You're switching with me. It's a snap mob. We're not gonna make it. Is it an on rail shooter? Ah! Blameless Murad had me released from prison, but why? Redemption Whoa. is still possible, Reyes. Climb the mountain. It's that Crytek game. Find out why the machines are attacking. Oh, we got the bow. A bow. No, no, there is moving and firing. The arrows. Do that, and you shall be a free man. It will take all your wits, your skills, and courage. Has it got better climbing mechanics than the actual main game? You have walked in the shadows, Reyes. Cool on the mountain. It is time to climb into the light. It'll probably be about an hour and a half long. Exclusively. Hi, don't, you don't say. I'm Ben McCaw, narrative director at Gorilla. I hope you enjoyed your first look at Horizon Call of the Mountain, coming exclusively to PlayStation VR 2. We're also happy to announce that a big update to Horizon Forbidden West, including New Game Plus, it make it good? will be available to download <laughs> on PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 today. Major update makes it good. Improved visual fidelity and performance mode. Switch outfit looks transmog. Reset skills. Ultra hard difficulty. Great. New Game Plus. I haven't finished the first, I haven't finished it once yet. <laughs> Let alone New Game Plus. For details on this free update, please check out PlayStation Blog. From all of us at Gorilla, thank you for your continued support, and please stay tuned for more updates to come. Get ready, a PlayStation fan favorite is coming to PC. A PlayStation fan favorite is coming to PC? What? Bloodborne? These past few oh, years, it's Spider Man. Sacrificing so much and asking for nothing. If you want to change Ooh. the world, you have to it's be. It's coming the to PC! Who can make the hardest decision? I planned them already. Do you really need two of those? You are everything that's wrong with this city! I'm gonna go, uh... 
do your thing. You can't just push people around like that. Just ask for help next time. Time to bring back the glory days. Remasters. Oh no, not the remastered version with the shitty face. The floor? Uh... Well, I have ray tracing, I guess. <gasps> Stray! Yay! The game I wanted to see. Stray! Release date, please. Please. Oh my god, it's a cat. Run away. Defcon 1. It's a cat. It's got ray tracing, apparently. <laughs> Not that I could tell. You can talk. Oh. You can talk to the cats. Can talk to robots. How dare you knock over the bottles? <laughs> um. Mirrors Edge. Cat edition. Hide in the box. <laughs> it's like snake. Release date, please. Not actual gameplay. I mean, it looks about as good as the actual gameplay graphics. I don't see why they need to say that. July 19th. <gasps> Only like a month and a half away or so. Explore a mysterious cyber city in Stray. Coming to PS5 and PS4 July 19th. And PC. PlayStation Plus extra members and higher can download Stray at no extra cost when it launches next month. Up next, three I games don't know. that will get your heart racing. Is that racing. what I'm going to be? Am I premium? I don't know. I don't know what... Well, sure. Star Citizen? No. Is this Star Citizen? What is it? Oh no, it's um, Dead Space! Oh my god. Not Dead Space. Take a look outside. But it is Dead Space. Did you know that they call Callisto the Dead Moon? Just like you would have been if I hadn't fished you out of that wreck. The celestial protocol, or something like that. Right there. It's dead space. It's just dead space. That's your old. It's life. dead space four. You gotta let that Unofficially. go. Because you're new With anthem robots. Is entirely in my hands. Ooh. This looks more impressive than the dead space remake. I'm just trying Ready. to give you a chance. At rebirth. That looked that look good. The face looked fucking real then, pretty much. Bam. Yeah, this is this is this is my kind of game, survival horror. That's bas basically necromorphs. Proper like weighty animations that like, throws you around. I just love that last part. I'm not. A, I'm not a fan of horror games. I like survival horror every games. Every I think there's a a big difference between the two. Ooh. Release date. Ooh. Yes. The year is saved with something coming out at least. Oh, this game. This game's out on PC already, I think. In the year 2030. No, no, it's, um, Oli Oli. Blood sport grips the globe. Isn't it? And in the arena, there will only be the victorious and the dead. And what the fuck? Hmm. It's got the art style of new Oli Oli game and another game that came out recently. Sable? 
Sable. It looks like Sable's graphics. So you roller skate and shoot people. <laughs> Massive fan of the graphics. The gameplay looks pretty cool. The world is watching. In Roller Drone. Roller Drone. Roller Drone. Roller Drone. Why not the Roller Dome? Sometimes I wonder if things will ever be normal again. Oh, anime, it's an anime. Captured on PS4. <laughs> Thank you. The world hasn't ended yet. It's not hopeless. I won't let anyone else get hurt! Don't you want science in your corner? <laughs> okay. Oh no. You. I'm going to miss them. Holding oh, hands, what if we touch hands? Only do. joking, unless... Welcome to the wizarding world of Eternites. Eternites? Eternites? Action games and dating sims collide in Eternites. Eternites. Coming to PS5 and PS4. So, why did you show PS4 year? gameplay? Let's check back in with Capcom for a new look at an upcoming heavy hitter. It's not that astronaut game, is it? <laughs> oh my god. Niner, you are psychic. What the fuck? Is it? Is it that? It looks like the, the same setting. Is it not? Oh, maybe it's not. Ah, oh. It's not. It's just set in, like, exactly the same, like, New York-looking area. When you go looking for strength, it's not like a game. This journey doesn't have a real ending. This should be called the Capcom state of play. Okay then, hope you're ready to begin. If you want to start off on the right foot in this city, hit the streets. Yeah, hey there, do this. Never fear lose. And when I get up in the game, you up here and prove a real prowler, but I solve so it's, it's Street Fighter. Yes. That's not Street Fighter. What the fuck is this? Or it is. It is not. It is? Well, you can run around <laughs> in an open world before fighting people in Street Fighter. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I wanted when I fucking play Street Fighter. I'm running around before the fight. What? Is it a spin off? Making it more like Mortal Kombat and stuff. More heavy, weighty attacks. Instead of like the really fast, quick, flashy stuff, I guess.
Hmm. So it's got a bit where you can run around. And a battle hub. It's PlayStation Home, but it's Street Fighter. <laughs> How strange. Is it a PlayStation exclusive? It can't be. Surely not. Surely not. That was your first look at Street Fighter VI gameplay. Mark your calendars. It comes to PS5 and PS4 in 2023. Now it's time Tunic. for two indie adventures arriving later this year. It's not very good. <laughs> Unfortunately. I love the exploration aspect of it and the graphics, but the gameplay is rubbish. The fighting, which is what you do 90% of the time, is rubbish. She set out to record life at the end of this season. To make it real for people in the future. She asked us about living together. They're big. And we asked her about traveling alone. When They're the stranding, turns, but you're on a bike. What will remain? <laughs> Only what she saw. What she captured. She There's carries the sounds of the, <laughs> the season floor. with her. Oh. It's Foley. The way she listened made you want to tell her everything. I got to look in her journal. The world was telling her its secrets. I think... She even figured out what will happen to us when the season ends. Is it in widescreen it like this? Whatever you call it. Ultra it wide, far? 21 by 9. Not yet. If you ride the bike around, you don't really see many games where you can ride a bicycle. Hello. Oh, Final Fantasy 16 is like the big thing. Okay. Oh, it's got the Japanese accent. I want more Final Fantasy VII Remake. I love that game, actually. Yeah, Final Fantasy is, oh, I can't stand it. It's awful. So it's going back to more it of a fantasy and our very being medieval breaks us it environment, us I guess. That its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. The icon. There's going to be another war, isn't there? <laughs> Every day we delay brings us closer to disaster. We must move now. That looks fake. That doesn't, but what we just saw looked fake. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. I and 
unite the dominance, that we may bring an end to the strife and found a new order to see us unto tomorrow. Huh. Seems like a combination of all the different Final Fantasy gameplay mechanics almost. If I take the field, our duel will shake the That's a big guy. To its foundations. Yeah, those one-on-one -on -one fights, they almost look fake. They look like those fake gaming ads you see for, like mobile games. Hellfire! I played a Final Fantasy game, so I'm in the Final Fantasy one. There will be losses, it is true. Yet for every citizen who falls, another. I recognize some of these um, summons, actually. Another can be built. The Empire will live on. That one, I recognize she will. So it's got like big monster battles, almost like Godzilla versus King Kong kind of battles, maybe, in it. And that's a wrap. Whoa. Don't forget to visit PlayStation Blog <laughs> to learn even more about today's announcements. See you next I'm time. I'm telling you, God of War is not coming out this year. <laughs> it's not coming out this year. No way. Well, they had some insanely massive stuff there. Resident Evil 4 Remake. Resident Evil Village coming to VR, Final Fantasy 16 proper trailer gameplay, uh, the Celestial Pro Protocol, uh, Stray trailer for release date, uh, da, 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 da. yeah, some Street Fighter 6 proper look at Street Fighter 6, massive big hitters that are probably going to sell a lot, I reckon, a lot. I just I was hoping we'd see some Resident Evil Village DLC. They say they're making it, but it's been a year. It's been over a year since the game came out. Normally DLC comes out like half a year after a game, so I'm surprised that we haven't seen any word on the DLC yet. Um hmm, I don't know. I was thinking maybe we'd see like something on the Last of Us remake. If that is happening, I think it is kind of a, still a rumor at this point, but people seem pretty damn sure that it's going to come. Uh, I think PlayStation is the only console I play. I've been playing on my PS5 a lot. I've been playing PlayStation Plus stuff quite a lot, actually. Uh, I'm most excited for this. Definitely. Dead. Like his face looks Just real like at some points. Almost. So whatever you're holding it's on to. It's just Dead right Space, there. but the next generation of Dead Space. It seems. That's your old life. Like, that looks pretty damn fucking good. You gotta let that go. Especially for because a crappy live stream quality. Life is entirely in my hands. Like the the movement. The throws his weight around a lot. I'm just trying to give you a chance at rebirth. Like that. I feel like you might. We're getting to the point where you might mistaken that for a real person, at least for a little bit, until you realize that it's actually a game. That looks pretty damn good, <laughs> I would say. I think we're we're getting to the point. Death Stranding. There's a few points in Death Stranding where if you paused it you might not realize that it's not the actual actor there. And, you know, we, we are starting to get there, I think. Oh, 
the, like, like it, that's like a massive hand cannon. It throws his hands like right back when he shoots it. And he's shooting the desert eagle. I just love that last part. And it comes out pretty soon, so we should, with six months, so we should see some more gameplay for it pretty soon if it's coming out in six months. Or less, five months, actually, I guess. No? Five, six months? Six months. Six months. Uh, so, yeah, it's not very far away, so I wouldn't be surprised if we saw some more gameplay for it. I don't even know how you spell that. I've got no idea. It was just there. Where's he gone? Oh, oh yeah, Spider-Man coming to PC, but I've platinum that already I on PS4, so I there's no reason for me to buy it. Uh, but it was my favourite game of that year. Uh, where was it? Where was it, Gary? Come on, you can do it. You, okay, the, the, what? No, stop. How do you spell it? This is properly like glitching out this. Woo, stop. It's two L's. Hmm. <laughs> well, people were right about Resident Evil 4. <laughs> people thought people were lying. It's an Unreal Engine 5 game. Oh, God. <laughs> it's going to run like shit. <laughs> oh, no. It's so heavy. Oh, dear. Will that be the first... Is it Unreal Engine 5? I'm going to look this up, actually. Yes. Will that be the first... What is the... F is there an Unreal Engine 5 game out yet? You got... Hellblade. Senua's Sacrifice. Something like that. Senua's something. That's... Unreal Engine 5. But what else? Games. I've spelled... i put UN. The UN... Uh, Senua's Saga for, for, te Fortnite is technically on UE5 but we don't count that so will this game be the first game to like properly come out oh no it might, oh, it might be this no did I finish up Red Dead yes I did Echoes of the End. Hmm, it just depends what comes out first. It could be... It could be... This game. Could be. It might... Might be. Indeed. Well... Not really, other than this, not really anything in there for me. Uh, but I can't deny that it's still, you know, it's massive games for a lot of people. Like, I'm not into Street Fighter. I don't really care about a Resident Evil 4 remake. I've, I've just played through the original. I don't think it needs a remake. I don't think Dead Space needs a remake either. Yeah, Stray. But I knew Stray was coming. I just wanted the release date. Um, but definitely some massive things in there. Final Fantasy 16. I'm intrigued. Some of the things look fake. Like, they've just put, like, UI elements on them. It just looks... It's just the camera angles look weird to have the UI on there. I don't know about that. Um... What, what other... There was something else that I thought there was no way that there could be Street Fighter 6, is that? That's not a PlayStation exclusive, is it? Ooh. 
Uh, oh, it's a console exclusive at launch. It's not coming to Xbox on Nintendo. It's, I don't know what Street Fighter is more played on normally. Is it? A, I wouldn't associate it with a with PlayStation myself, but I don't play Street Fighter. Um, I'm guessing it's going to come to PC. If it's a normally like PS4, PS5 console exclusives usually come to PC at some point, um, especially ones that aren't first party. Uh, Final Fantasy 16. Is this on PC? This is on PC as well. Okay, so it's annoying that they don't say that it's on PC in the state of play. I get that they're. I get that it's a PlayStation conference live stream, but they could announce like people who are playing on PC. They're not going to buy it on PlayStation probably, unless they're me. <laughs> I. I'm like I'm an enigma, I think. I'm an anomaly. I don't really care what I play it on as long as it runs okay at <laughs> like 60 frames a second. I don't really care. I just want the Final Fantasy remake part 2. I mean, how long is it going to be before the remake is finished? PC players aren't watching. I'm watching. <laughs> I'm watching. Oh, it's probably a, an Epic Store exclusive. I wouldn't be surprised. I don't even know how you how you spell 16 with, with Roman numerals. V I? No, it's I V, isn't it? No idea. No. V I. I guess it's not on there yet. Well, I play everything. I play all of them. All of them. Everything. All of them. Apart from the play date. <laughs> I don't. I don't have a play date. But it looks cool. So. But is it is it day and day? Stray has a has price now, July July nineteenth. But it said something about it being free on PlayStation Plus if you own the premium tier or something. I'm not. I haven't really kept up with the whole PlayStation revamp, PlayStation Plus revamp. So I don't really know what's going on. It just seems like it's there to confuse the shit out of everyone. It will be part of the revamped PS Plus library. But what tier did it say? I can't remember. I didn't, I didn't catch it. Ad blocker. Ad blocker. I'm pretty sure, well, if you have ad blocker on this uh, site, it won't let you use it. <laughs> Can't see it. PS Plus Extra and Premium. What oh, fuck me? So Essential is the standard one. So I, I'm not gonna get extra or premium. So I'll probably just end up playing it on PC. Um, to be fair, unless they have like a free trial for the for the new tiers, but I I doubt it. Uh, you are premium if you already have it. I thought it was essential. You stick with <laughs> PS Plus essential. So you got essential is the sta premium is the top tier one. So they're not going to give you premium just because you already have it, you know, the standard one, surely. Fuck me. 
available globally. Is the price going up? £50 a year. No, it's the same price. At least yearly. Extra is <laughs> extra is £84. And £100 for premium. Fuck me. Christ alive. Existing... Oh, I'm not PlayStation... I'm not PlayStation now. I'm PlayStation Plus. So, I guess I'll just play it on PC. I'll buy it on PC, probably. It's got ray tracing, and I can't use ray tracing. So if I want, oh, if I want ray tracing, I'd have to buy it on the PS5, because I my graphics card can't do ray tracing. But to be fair, I'd probably play it on the mode that doesn't have ray tracing, like performance mode, if it has that. I don't know. Get a new GPU, yes, sure. <laughs> but I wouldn't turn it on anyway, because I hate the performance hit. It's such a massive performance hit. And I wouldn't even know. I, I'm not someone who notices that. Um, but there are a lot of shiny reflections. There's a lot of water. There's a lot of rain. There's a lot of shiny reflections. A lot of neon lights. It could be a ray tracing dream. <laughs> I mean, have you seen Hitman? The new Hitman ray tracing update? My God. It doesn't even look very good. It just runs so badly. You, like, cut your performance by, like, a third or two thirds. You go from, like, 150 frames to, like, 60 frames a second by turning it on. It doesn't, it doesn't even look, in, you know, in a lot of cases, it doesn't look that good. Yeah, 60 FPS is fine, but when you're going from 150, it's ridiculous. <laughs> Have a nice death. Lovely. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, patch notes. Ray tracing. Blah, blah, blah. The ducky gun. Uh. <laughs> Some maintain that it's not really possible for the human eye to perceive more than 60 frames per second. Well, I can. Like, sometimes, because... Windows uh, multi-monitor support is dodgy at the best of times. Sometimes it will revert the refresh rate back to 60 hertz, and I'll be like, why does this feel like shit? <laughs> and, I go, and I go look at the display settings. I'm like, ah, that's why, because it's running at 60 hertz. No connection. Oh, no. Steam, have you died? No, you're fine. Ooh, cyberpunk cat adventure. Stray. Well, I'm glad that they've announced stuff and the release dates are not that far away. I'm sick of games being announced and then they're like, five years later, it's still not out. Ooh. Go away. Uh, where was that bit? Like this bit here. God, YouTube's compression. Oh, I don't know if I can run at 4K while the stream's going. Disaster. We must nope. move now. Uh. It's weird. If I, I think, if I, hang on a minute. 
if I do this. There's something going on with OBS and hardware acceleration in Google Chrome that is messed up at the moment. I need to turn it off for it to actually work properly. Who are we? It unmakes us. That like this bit here. The delay brings us close this looks to... fake. This doesn't look real. I'm telling you, this looks like one of those fake gaming ads for a mobile phone. Every day, the delay brings us closer that to It doesn't look real. That looks fake. We must move now. It's just the, the camera angle would make it look fake. I think. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. Must move now. If you use like big claymores and stuff, that'd be awesome. The chaos he would wreak would sweep. I hope they make maybe because in Final Fantasy like seven remake and a lot of Final Fantasy games, the actual basic combat of just like swinging the swords is not necessarily the best. So if they could make that a bit better on top of having all of the awesome special abilities, that would be cool. All of Valisthea into the abyss. Ooh, ooh. Which I feel like they've done here. It looks more combo based. You still got the whole staggering mechanics. I do love that Final I Fantasy gameplay. That we may bring it's so it satisfying to, to stagger an enemy and then do massive and damage. New order to see us onto tomorrow. It looks a lot better. It looks a lot better in the actual uh, YouTube video and not the live stream. <laughs> the live stream looks like shit. If I take the field, our duel will shake the island. But they, that, I mean, if you showed that to me, I would think that was that new Stranger of Paradise uh, Final Fantasy game. Like, the character models look a lot like that. It's foundations. Oh, oh. So you got these massive summon battles, but how much control do you have in these fights? Do you, do you actually control it? I mean, what's going on here? You controlling these as it's going on? I don't know. Because to me, it looks like they've just overlaid a fake UI on top of a cutscene. There will be losses, it is true. Yet for every citizen who falls, another can be bred. For every home that burns, another can be built. The Empire will live on. But what's the actual gameplay in between fighting? Because a lot of the gameplay in between fighting is not very good in Final Fantasy games. Like even the remake, which I love, of 7. Actually exploring... The areas, the areas are very small. They're just corridors, basically, and there's not a lot to do, really. Um, the fighting is the meat of the game. So I hope they can make the bits in between fighting more interesting, Every day, more open. Brings us closer to disaster. Like Final Fantasy go. is the type of game that gives you a car and doesn't let you drive it. <laughs> Final Fantasy XV doesn't let you actually drive the car. You just have to sit in it, sit in it while it fucking drives you to a place. It's, it's so bad. Move now. The chaos I always, I like this here. It's that Dragon's Dogma style of thing where if you press the trigger, you get like another four abilities to use. I I really like that way of mapping controls and abilities. The chaos you well, that's a year away. And they announced that. When did they announce this? They announced this like two years ago. So they did announce this way too early, I think. Twenty twenty, they announced it. So three years from the time of announcement, they announced it far too early. 
far too early. But well, so my my conclusion is that despite it not necessarily being my kind of games, apart from the Dead Space thing, uh, I can still see that it is a massive uh, load of games that are very important to a lot of people. Jax is playing New Diablo. New Diablo? Do you mean Di Diablo Immortal? What one? Diablo 4? Which one? You mean this one? For which one? <laughs> Immortal? Immortal's the shit phone one. The, can, what? Well, is he playing? Is he actually playing it on the phone? I, can you play it on PC? You can play it on PC. Why would you want to play a phone game on PC? This is it. The dock for Wortham. That whole village has gone to hell. You sure I can't take you someplace else? Yes, I am. This is the path to town then. Aye. Follow the road and be on your guard. I'm Sean Bean. Things happen to travelers in that forest. Barbarian. I'm no defenseless pup. Still, I thank you for the advice. It's like a stopgap between the three and four. Dead. What fate has befallen Wortham? To quench the first. I mean, it looks very similar to free actually, in the environments at least. Consumed by darkness. Look at this though, the basic like two button combat. <laughs> you want to press the left click, or do you want to press the right click? Oh, you can't move forward unless you fight the enemy. Still I just want it to be like a, a game where you buy and you get all the content when you buy it. The ancients grant me strength. <laughs> An outsider, drawn where they do not belong. Uh, I like that you can s I, f I feel like you can see more of the detail on the character. More of what the character is actually using and wearing. But because it is more zoomed in, the fights are a lot smaller, I guess. Can you zoom out any more than that? I guess it's because it's on a phone. You can't zoom out on a phone. You wouldn't be able to see anything. Looks like Diablo. <laughs> Pretty much. Lord Skarn, the shard is ours, and the right is nearly finished. So how do you, how do you play it? Don't have a phone? <laughs> no, I don't have a phone. I don't have a phone that could probably play this. Uh... Play now. Demons await. Oh, you can just download it. Sure. <laughs> okay. That was Battle.net. Is, is it loading Battle.net? I thought they were sunsetting. I thought Battle.net wasn't really a thing anymore. I thought they were moving back to Steam. Because Call of Duty is coming back to Steam, I think. With Modern Warfare 2.
I mean, how are you supposed to find it? Because <laughs> it's called Modern Warfare 2. And there's already a game called Modern Warfare 2. Is it MW2? Maybe there's no listing for it yet. Yeah. Warhammer? Well, what about Space Marine? I'd like to play that, actually, before the new one comes out on PC. Is that on here? They See, what they when they announced the new one, they upped the price to full price again, which is ridiculous. Uh, and so even on a sale, it's still more than it should be. It should be like £3.75. I'm not saying it's not worth £10. It is. I think it's a, a really cool game. I might buy it. Maybe I'll play through this next. <laughs> I do like a good third person shooter. With cool melee stuff as well. I've played a bit of it on PlayStation 3. Uh, it doesn't run very well, so I'd like to play like the actual PC version with nice, nice controls and graphics and frame rate. I might, I might, I might buy it. Actually, I might think about it. How long's the sale on for? The 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 a week, a week, a week, a week. Is the multiplayer still active? Steam Deck compatibility playable. Well, uh, I think that's going to be it, though, for today. Uh, I'm finished with Red Dead 2, so we're going to move on to something else. What that will be, I don't know. I need a toilet. So I'm going to say goodbye and thank you for watching. I thought the state of play was good. Just not necessarily stuff that I'm interested in. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.